Hey guys, it's Kendra. Today I'm here to do a bathroom organization video for you. I've never showed you how we have everything organized underneath the vanity. So I want to go into that, show you how I have my makeup, my hair products, and everything just stored. And as I show you that, I'm also going to be going through stuff and kind of rearranging things. Another thing I want to do is to, I have a lot of skincare products in my office. I have kind of like backups and things that I'm not using, but since our baby boy's nursery now, his closet needs to be cleared out. I need to make room for that stuff. So I'm gonna do my best to fit more in this bathroom and maybe just go through it and get rid of stuff that I don't need. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoy this. If you're into organization and cleaning stuff, this video is for you, so let's get started. Okay, so first I just need to kind of tidy up everything. I'll put everything away and then we will get to the organizing, but first I wanna show you a quick overview of what, how everything is right now. So in here I have all of my skincare. And if you guys want links to like specific things in this bathroom, I will put the video to our uh, bathroom renovation down below for you. Up here, I have my everyday makeup, which needs a massive clean. In the middle drawer, I have hot tools on the bottom drawer. I have travel bags, it's all travel bags. The left side's Andrews, so I have to go through that. I'll do that, like, well, that's not very exciting, but I, let me just show you. And here, we have like cleaning stuff, extra towels, extra cotton pads, Q-tips, and his like shaving things and band-aids down there. So here's my side. And I used to have all of my hair stuff in my office closet, which had all of my beauty products, but I recently brought these in here and I love it so much more. But what I wanna do is categorize it more into like dry shampoos and, you know, go by category, because right now it's all just a mess. And then I have extra space back here, so that's why I'm thinking I'm gonna bring more stuff that I have in the office closet into here. Down here, these things don't necessarily correlate to what's in there except the mask and the miscellaneous. So I'll go through all of these. It needs to just be kind of cleaned out and just sorted through. So that's what we're working with. I'm gonna go ahead and just clean everything up a bit and then we'll start with makeup. So I am going to take all of this out, put it on the counter, and kind of see what we have. So first, for my palettes, I'm gonna put, this is new, guys, the Naked Reloaded palette. It is so amazing, like the colors are my dream colors, basically. So I'm gonna put that there because that's what I've been using like every day. I use this for my eyebrows. I don't think, oh, that'll fit there, that's perfect. I don't need to keep my heat, naked petite heat palette in here because it has all the colors in here that I need now, so I'm gonna put that away back where my other makeup is. This is my NARS eyeshadow. I love this, but honestly, I just need that right now. My Cover FX palette, I am going to put this away right now. I wanna trade this out for some other things, um, some other highlighters, so that again is gonna go back. Over here, I like to keep my compacts. Hi, baby. What are you doing? I'm playing outside. You're playing outside with Daddy? You wanna say hi? I want Mommy to play outside. You want Mommy to play outside? Okay, Mineral Fusion Powder, my Laura Geller blush, love that. And my Chanel Cream Bronzer. This is like not amazing. I thought it was gonna be a lot better, but I still use it. And my Too Faced Bronzer. I've been using my Hourglass Blush too. So I'll put that there. And then my Stila Cream Blush. This is a um, cream highlight by RMS. Here I usually have like foundation. So let's see, 
I'm gonna do, I've actually been using all of these. My Makeup Forever HD, my Lawless Woke Up Like This, and then my Pacifica um, CC Cream. I'm gonna keep all of those in here. And then for concealers, I have my Urban Decay and my Cover FX Concealer. I'm gonna pop those in there as well. Back here, I like to keep my tools. So I have scissors, I have some nail clippers, tweezers, my sharpener goes there. And then on this side, I like to have my lip products. So I have my Bite Beauty lip mask. This is from Wander Beauty. It's a lip balm, it's really nice. An Urban Decay lip gloss and an Aveda lipstick. I forgot about this. <laughs> my Paracon MD No Eyeshadow Eyeshadow. This is super nice. I will keep that back here as well. And I can just pop that right there. And I'll also put my eyeliner back here just since it's like an odd shape. I always lose it, so I'll put that there. This I'm gonna get rid of. It's the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. I thought I really liked it, and it just is not as good as I thought it was. So I'm gonna do brushes in here, and then actual products in this drawer. So we have my eyebrow gel. This again I'm giving away, the, or no, actually I'm gonna get rid of this because that's nasty to give that away. Cover Girl Mascara, I don't like this, so. I just need to weave through some of these things, clearly. Okay, Stila, liquid, lip, liquid liner, voluminous, mascara, better than sex mascara. This is almost gone, I'm trying to work through this. They're Arborian CC Cream. I actually am gonna put this in my medicine cabinet because I find that I use it more that way. And then, let's see, my eyebrow pencil can go there. I got my blush brush. I have, this is for cream products. I like this for cream blush and highlighter. Bronzer, cream bronzer. <laughs> Sounds so excessive. Powder, foundation, eyeshadow brushes. Let's see, how many do I need? We got liner. I actually use like all of these. So actually I was putting my eyeshadow brushes, let's put these concealers back and I'll put these eye brushes in here. That works. And then this will be like complexion brushes. This is for contouring because my face is getting a lot larger these days and this can be for like concealer. Okay, that's good. And um, this will go in there. So that looks a lot better. I can kind of see everything a little more clearly now. Okay, moving down to this drawer, this is where I have hair stuff. So I just wanna kind of tidy this up and then we'll put like hair ties and bobby pins together and whatnot. So I grabbed this little box so I'm gonna put that there and that'll be for bobby pins and hair ties. And you know what, I'm gonna take these off. I'm gonna do blow dryer. Yeah, that needs to be smaller so these can lay flat. I found one that's thinner, so we're gonna do this instead. And then I have a brush and a teasing brush and those I can stick in there as well. So this I'm gonna put on Andrew's side because that's where we have like everything that's kind of like charging stuff. So that'll go over on his side and then I can have space for whatever here. I actually like to keep toilet paper there. Right now it's down here. So I'll stock that up. Here I have some ring boxes that can stay back there. I'm gonna take these down and we will go through all of my hair stuff right now. And back here I have um, tampons and pads. Definitely not needing to use these for a while. So that can stay back there. So this is all my hair stuff. I just went into my beauty closet. I have a lot of skincare backup, so we'll go through that in a sec. Um, and I found another one of these. I'm probably gonna have to put skincare stuff in here. And it'll be like extra stuff, and I might just keep that back there. I 
have two thick bean tonics. I don't need two of them, so I'll get rid of one. I also have two of these Briogeo leaves. They're kind of different, but I don't need a travel one. I just usually just take the full size. I think I have two damage remedies. Um, this one's different, but let's see. Oh, daily hair repair. This is a travel size of this. I can get rid of the travel size and give that away because I can just be fine with this guy. So this is gonna be like leave-in treatments. Okay, dry shampoos. We have Cure, Riogeo, Shampure, and another Shampure. This is a backup of Shampure, so I'm gonna be nice. I'll put this over here. Well, I guess I'll keep it there with that. This one is from um, Alterna. Okay. Oh, Detox by Dry Bar. Also, I have the dry conditioner. I'm gonna stick that in there as well. Will that fit? Okay, this I don't really ever use, the Living Proof Nightcap, so I'm gonna give that away. I also have the Living Proof Fresh Cut Split End Mender. These, I have a couple things like this. I have the Aveda one too. These are similar. Um, let's do styling treatments in a sep, this one can go over here. Styling treatments. So things that like smooth out your hair. I have the Aveda Smooth Infusion. Both of these I love. Texturizing sprays can go over here. That's from Rockin Oil. Leave-in conditioner. This is like a leave-in oil from Kerastase. Stick that with those. This is a blow dry spray that kind of speeds up when you blow dry your hair. That can go in here as well. I like to kind of keep them because I know that's what you use on wet hair. Another dry conditioner. Oh, this one is a new one. So. Again, I'll stick a backup over here. Travel size of the thickening tonic, I can give that away. I have a scalp, a couple scalp treatments. Those can go over here, like treatment things. Okay, oh, I do have another damage remedy. Is this one new? I thought I had one that was new. Shoot, did I open two? Ugh, okay, so we'll use that one at first, and then this will be with my backups. Detangling spray, though, that can go here barely fits. Let's turn this upside down. I have a thickening foam. Love that stuff. Surf spray can go in here. Another surf spray from Alterna. This is Beach Wave Mousse. I never used this. Hmm. I need to try to use this. Let me put that in there. And then I have some shine sprays that can go over here. These are like finishing type products. This is like a finishing product, all these. This is like an oil. Um, this is a shine cream. And then my hairspray, I think that'll fit in there too. I'll stick these with this stuff. Here we have dry shampoo, leave-in treatment. So everything that I use like on wet hair when I get out of the shower is all right here. And then that goes into like smoothing treatments, scalp treatments and whatnot. I love, I love that. This is stuff I finish my hair with, shine products, smoothing. I have some texturizing products here, hairspray, and then backup things. All right, let's move on to skincare. So well, actually, let me just show you what I have in here. Extra razors, um, extra eye drops. I have LASIK, so I just use these every now and then to like refresh my eyes. I have a cleaner for my rings. Actually, I can put these ring boxes down here. And then I have my Clarisonic charger and then an extra deodorant right there. And then I have all of my face masks here. I'm kind of obsessed. I have miscellaneous skincare here. And then this is like miscellaneous body stuff. I did find this box of all of this skincare. Let me see, okay, these, I have some more Tatcha face masks. So these can go in here. I think I wanna take all my body products out and we'll put those behind the skincare things. I don't, the body products I use like on a daily basis, I have above our toilet, but other stuff I'll stick over here. That is empty, why is that in there? Backup cleansers, we have one from Fresh, Image, Andalou, Osea, and then we have a couple toners. Fresh, Reviva Labs. This is a body cream from Ren. So that'll go with the body stuff. Um, some wipes. Those can go in here, actually. A Ren body serum, this looks awesome. I wanna try this so bad. 
Veda Rosemary Mint Body Lotion. Um, this can go in the girls' room. It's like baby stuff. We have a Kopari Detox Mask. I just don't need this. I'm gonna give this away. Since these are all things I'm not currently using, I'm gonna put these in the back, but these won't fit. Okay, so these will go up top. You know what? I don't use this stuff all the time, so I will put this in the back. So in here, we're gonna do, let's see. Oh, here's like my just for men. This is the stuff that I use for tinting my eyebrows. These are eye masks. I'm not, I don't use eye masks often. I'm gonna give those away. I'm gonna put this in the shower. This smells so good. It's by Fresh. It's their face oh, polish. So that'll go in the shower. And then these are not opened. I got these from Algenis. Sleeping collagen. This is anti-aging cream. Okay, these are all like BB creams and day creams with SPF. So I'm gonna categorize those together. I'm gonna put one of these in my medicine cabinet. I'm gonna try to use the Andalou one and finish that. So that's gonna go up in my medicine cabinet, get some use. We'll save these two until I use one of those ones up. I'm trying to use things up before I open new ones. Same with this one. This is a balancing serum from Image. This is the Tatcha Dewy Skin Night Concentrate. So let's do like night creams. Over here, we have overnight peel. This one is an eye concentrate. I actually should start using that now. Okay, that's gonna come up into the medicine cabinet because I don't have an eye cream right now. And this is a Radiance Glow Daily Vitamin C Gel Cream. This looks awesome too. Maybe I should put both these in the, let's just give them both a shot. And now I'm going through my masks. I'm just kind of looking through them and refreshing my mind on what ones I have because I do have a lot. But I use them all the time. I typically keep two to three of them in the shower. And then every now and then I'll come down here and grab a new one to use and I'll just kind of rotate them out. Okay, so I'm gonna put some body care in here. Sunscreen, tanner, some after sun lotion, more body lotion, some oil, some more oils that I can put in the guest bathroom. But I think this is good in here for now. And then I'm gonna take the tanner out because I'm not tanning right now since I'm pregnant, like I just haven't been using this. So I think this works for now. Okay, I will do a separate video showing the guest bathroom and how I'm gonna organize that with like the girls stuff. And who knows, I might get rid of some more stuff, we'll see. But I didn't even get to the medicine cabinet. Let me know if you want me to talk about the medicine cabinet when I do the guest bathroom. I'm gonna end the video here because I gotta go relieve Andrew and feed the girls and whatnot. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing all of this. This was very satisfying and it just makes me very happy organizing like all my products. So. Thank you for watching and I will see you guys very, very soon.